Shocking news, Boris Johnson, the Prime Minister of course, is resigning and also over 50 of his cabinet have already gone. So what we're discussing here is my viewpoint on what we think is going to actually happen to the property investing and the property developing environment in the UK. Now, if you're joining me for the first time, my name is Cam Devady. I'm the founder of Premier Property Group and an investor developer over the last 30 years. And I also, of course, help people to upskill and train in property as well. And my view is that actually there is a number of changes that are going to happen now that the acceleration process has happened of Boris Johnson actually leaving government. So what are these specifically? So first of all, number one is uncertain times. Now, with uncertain times, what that means is for people like you and I, there are opportunities that come along, obviously, but when they happen, you can really capitalize on the opportunities that are right in front of you. So specifically, really assessing real good investing areas where you can jump in, where the heat is coming off the market and the, uh, how can we say, I don't want to say amateur, but you know, normal investors are being pushed out of the market and professional investors like you um, listening to things like this and, and uh, viewpoints of uh, actual investors, you know, you can actually jump into some really good strategies, some really good areas where that heat is coming off the market and you will notice that happening over the next few months. Now we have the new Chancellor, Nadim Zahawi, and uh, of course they're discussing bringing in tax breaks. Now, of course that's uh, good for people that pay tax, of course, that's for all of us. So uh, there'll be some tax mitigation. However, on the flip side of that, that is going to mean interest rates are going to rise much faster than you actually think. So what do we do? So right now, if you're already jumping into property, now's the time to get your finance sorted ASAP while you still have the chance. And uh, if you're like me and you're an experienced investor, well, that's all good because um, now is the time to actually be looking for ways that you can be refinancing as quick as you possibly can. What we're doing right now is we're going into five year fixes with many of our uh, uh, mortgages that we have, financing that we have, and uh, the process can actually start, typically depending on the lender, between four to six months before you're actually up for your renewal. So we are assessing this right now, and the advantage also of you doing this now is it will lock in for you the actual interest rate. So once your application goes in, for your refinance or your starting out finance, you're locked in with that uh, that number, that interest rate number, and the lender will honor that as you go through the process. Also, inflation, of course, inflation is already in double digits, and uh, we know that inflation isn't really what the Bank of England are saying it is at the moment, because they are measuring it in um, their traditional basket of goods. Um, but the basket of goods that we buy uh, is, tends to be different, doesn't it? I mean, you've only got to look at your t utility bills, you've only got to look at your, when you're filling up your petrol, your diesel, uh, you get my point, right? Inflation is much higher. So what do we do? Now, it's not great for the economy, of course, but as property investors and developers, where you can take charge of your own economy, your own financial economy, one of the things that we find at Premier is the advantage of leverage. So when we're financing deals and you can finance your deals, rather than buying cash, that finance, that money that you're getting from the lender, somebody's money sitting in a bank, your money sitting in a bank, or money that you're borrowing is still money. And my point is that inflation is eroding both. So money in the bank is, of course, being eroded. And we're in double-digit growth. Um, the Bank of England are saying heading towards 11%. And that's a massive amount, isn't it? But in real terms, my view is we're, we're more near the 15 to 20%. Really, that's really where we are. Which means the money in the bank is being eroded by 20% which is quite shocking, isn't it, in real terms? That's a lot of money being thrown down the drain. So cost of living, of course, is increasing. And at the same time, interest rates are going up. That is all fueling the inflation going up as well. Um, but like what I say, there's a number of things that you can be doing to actually minimize the impact and actually using that as an opportunity for you to be investing in property. My view moving forward over this year and, and next year is that we're gonna head into a deeper recession, which to be fair, isn't that bad as a property investor and developer. These are moments that you know you really want to be finding over, a, and they come along over a 10 to 20 year period. And we have these opportunities right now. So as long as you are professionalizing, as long as you have continued professional development in your property career, whether that's part-time or full-time, and as long as you're upskilling 
and really using these uh, to your advantage, um, I think you're going to be in a very good space and uh, we just got to keep our head and we just got to do things in the right way. I'm all about ongoing learning. Um, I love learning myself and of course I have a number of students and people in our community that I share information with as well. And I think it's really key to keep your head in times like this when everybody else is losing theirs. So that's my view for you. Uh, not too concerned that the government is changing. Property investing and developing is here to stay. Your ultimate time to jump in and really make this work. Uh, now if you're watching some YouTube, I've got a lot of other videos here as well, so feel free to sort of jump around on our channel and just pick the ones that are relevant for you and have a good watch of this because all I'm sharing with you is exactly what we are doing day to day. It's Cam Dubedi helping you with your property investing, taking it to the next level. I'll see you on the next uh, video. And if you haven't subscribed, feel free to subscribe here. Bye for now. Thank you.